pursuit ended on Whittier Boulevard here right in front of that car dealership, giving everyone inside a front row seat to a very strange end to that standoff. Qué bonito. Witnesses capturing the bizarre end to a pursuit and standoff in Montebello. The suspects hugging and kissing before being taken down by police. The guy was just trying to hold her back and they, they finally both got out and he was still trying, like hugging her. And the, the cops got around the, the lady and tasered the guy twice. Francisco Pena capturing the crazy scene while at work at Montebello Chevrolet. The pursuit coming to a sudden stop right out front. As soon as I'm coming out of the liquor store, I see this car skidding down to a halt and uh, sirens blast in, everything blast in. Um, didn't really know what to think of it. It all started around 10.30 this morning when Bell Gardens police spotted the stolen U-Haul truck and the chase was on. The pickup riding on its rim after hitting a spike strip and losing a front tire. As they made their way into Montebello, they hit another vehicle. Thankfully, that driver wasn't injured. The suspects finally coming to a stop on Whittier Boulevard, waiting it out, drinking and kissing, witnesses say, as police tried to convince them to give up. After 20 minutes, the female suspect climbed out, followed by the male, who grabbed her and hugged her and wouldn't let go until police moved in. Oh, they're going to tase him. Oh. Oh. Taking him down with what appeared to be a taser, a dramatic end to an unusual standoff. I think it was kind of extra. <laughs> like there was like six helicopters and then all these police officers. And then I guess the SWAT team also came. I just felt like it was a little too much. Both suspects were taken to the hospital to be checked out. Authorities say both of them were under the influence of drugs and alcohol. They likely will face a long list of charges.